What is going on guys? I am Jehovah and this is some Black Ops 2 gameplay here today. Playing some Kill Confirmed on Yammern and uh, having some fun. I, I still, I love this game so much. The, the guys and I, we've been talking lately about how much, uh, how much we miss Black Ops 2. Like you don't realize how good a Call of Duty is until you go back to it years later. Um, you know, Black Ops 2 came out and I played the shit out of it and I had never prestiged in a Call of Duty before because I just was like, eh, what's the point? Black Ops 2, I figured I'd give it a try and I ended up getting, uh, you know, Prestige Master in this game and I've had Prestige Master for a long time. You know, if I would have went into Prestige again, I probably could have, who knows, but uh, the point is, is that Black Ops 2 is a damn good game, and uh, I think it's something that we, like, overlook. Because you go back to it now, and you're like, wow, the, the pick 10 system makes sense. Uh, you know, the classes with the the perks and everything, it just, it makes sense. The kill streaks make sense. They're fun to go for. Um, you know, the, the hit detection and everything feels pretty fucking solid. I mean... Any shooter is, I, don't, I, I really don't think, you know, maybe 20 years from now or something when everybody has, uh, you know, a thousand up and thousand down connections and, and hardware that's absolutely insane. Um, you know, maybe then we'll have like something that feels perfect or more so perfect. Um, but I think any shooter is going to have a little bit of that like, ah, I was kind of around the corner already and I died type thing. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, I mean, Black Ops 2 just feels so good to play. It really does. Like, I don't know, the movement, the control, the shooting, uh, you know, it just everything makes sense. It's a good Call of Duty. It really is. And uh, I enjoy the hell out of it. I'm hoping um, that when Advanced Warfare comes out here in, what, a month? Uh, wait, no, two months? Um, that it's going to be... A lot like this game I hope I hope I hope I hope I really really hope you know they took from they took from this game a little bit you know with like the pick 10 system now there's pick 13 and all that good stuff and I just I really hope that I enjoy it on the level of uh, of this game look, look at this part right here man I'm just I'm baiting these tags I'm, I'm being the, I'm being that guy right now but that's how you're, you're supposed to play kill confirmed right you know like you gotta go for your tags, but at the same time, use them to your advantage. I, I knew these dumbasses were gonna keep trying to run out of there and and grab those tags, and I'm just taking advantage. So I got the UAV, I got the VSAT, and I got the load star. I hadn't had a load star in a long time. Figured I'd try it out. I actually get it here in a second, and uh, I don't do too well to, with it. I only get a few kills uh, before they shoot me down out of it. But it was a good time. You know, I enjoyed myself. And uh, I think I only end up dying twice in this gameplay and uh, doing pretty well, especially for joining in late. You know, I think the score was like 39 to 20 something. Uh, my team was already up, but uh, joining in joining in that late and doing some work feels good. And uh, it's just awesome that Black Ops 2 is one of those games where I can jump on and consistently do decent, at least. You know, I never feel like I lost my touch or anything. Not that uh, my touch has ever been that great at this game. But I do, uh, I do hold my own. I feel like you know what I mean. So uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun, and that's and I said it before. I really feel like if Advanced Warfare um, is gonna be good, like one of the things that'll make a good Call of Duty is just kill streaks, like straight up. I mean, obviously there's a lot of things that go into it, like I was saying earlier. You know, like hit detection and just what it feels like in a movement you know like your movement is you don't think about it but just the way it feels to like mantle that rock right there or sprint down the street or aim down sights that's a huge thing um with shooters and if they don't get that right then it can just feel wrong from the beginning and you just won't have fun but uh one of the things that i think is really going to help that any any call of duty coming on coming out from here on out is uh if the kill streaks are fun to go for and they present a challenge um, to acquire, then it's going to be a good Call of Duty. It's it's at least going to have replayability. Replayability is that a thing? Replayability? Sure. You know what? We made it a thing. So, um, you know, and, and I think, like I said before, because the kill streaks are coming out with Advanced Warfare, and they're like customizable. Look at me. Just I, I see their spawn here, and I'm like, you know what? Yes, I'm going in. I'm going in hard on this spawn right now, and I just I just annihilate everyone. I made them all instantaneously diarrhea in their pants but yeah i mean uh you know if those things are fun to go for i'm gonna keep playing it and it's gonna be good and i'm gonna enjoy it and i'm gonna want it i'm gonna desire playing it because ghost wasn't that game for me and i think a lot of people 
Can't agree, but we're getting closer, guys. Advanced Warfare is right around the corner. New games are coming out as we speak, and uh, yeah, we're going to have fun together. So 21 and 2, uh, not that huge of a spread, but still pretty decent. Got myself my, my kill streaks. I had a little fun. Ended off the game with a look at that accuracy. Damn! Damn, I'm good. I'm really not into that, into myself that much, guys. I just, I just like to act like I am sometimes. But seriously, I'm fucking awesome. I love you guys. I'll talk to you later.